Hi there. How you doing? How's the fam? I know, it's been a while. Uh, first of all, welcome to the stream. It's been, a, it's been a hot minute since I streamed, about two weeks, I think. First four. Um, for those of you who follow me on Twitter or Tumblr, you know that I broke my tailbone, which made sitting in one spot for very long just too painful. I needed to like lie down or stand up or something. So I haven't streamed in two weeks. So that's why you haven't been seeing me. If you're curious, I don't know how I broke my tailbone. <laughs> I've made no secret of the fact that I'm ancient. <laughs> and I woke up like that. Like one morning. I just woke up with a broken tailbone. It's great. Love it. Okay. So yeah. I was out of commission for like two weeks because I couldn't sit down. Uh, the first day I couldn't walk either. Okay, so if you follow, if you watched the last stream, you know that I just spent a ridiculous amount of time trying to figure out how to get to Estar because we went up. Mm -hmm, yeah, we went up uh, to the thing, and they're like, "Okay, make a path to Estar," and I couldn't figure out how to get there. Guess what the answer was? The answer was not fucking going to Estar. Apparently, you have to go back to the infirm infirmary, even though it didn't tell me to, to pick up... Mm -ah, let me just punch my mic. That's how heated I am. <laughs> uh, you have to go back to the infirmary to pick up Renoa, uh, because that's how you get to Estar. Didn't tell me. Don't know why I would think to do this, because we had just left her. But, well, here we are. It's great. So, yeah. That's why I couldn't find my way to Estar last stream. Because you can't actually get there. You gotta... You gotta carry Renoa by going back to her. I guess. It's pretty far. I didn't think it would be this far. I'm bad with distances. What am I doing? Go to Estar, find a loan, talk to a loan. But there's no guarantee that everything will be resolved if I talk to a loan. Even so, I'm... I... Sure have changed. Very rapidly, too. Like, during the battle, I was like, please stop flirting with me. And then she falls during the battle, I'm like, oh my god, I love you, Renoa. I don't like to think about it. I wonder what everyone's doing. They're probably laughing at me. Or maybe they're angry. What do you think? To tell you the truth, I worry too much about what others think of me. I hate that side of me. That's why I didn't want anyone to get to know me. I wanted to hide that side of myself. I hate it. Squall is an unfriendly, introverted guy. It made it easy for me when people perceived me that way. That's a secret between you and me. Got that? Renoa. Actually, probably he should have been like, Renoa. You're dead weight, girl. Squall, you're late. Is the princess still asleep? She might wake up with a kiss from the prince. Is that why you came all the way out here to tell me that? Also, how the fuck did you pass me on that railway? <laughs> Since it's over the ocean and you can't, like, go around. You know what? You're going to S, though, right? We're coming, too. We're Edie as escort. Let 
Let us be on our way, Squall. We shall leave as soon as we're ready. What business do you have in Esthar? I must go see Dr. Odine. Dr. Odine, you've heard that name, right? I know we have, but I just want more info. Tell me more. You know the famous Odine brand, don't you? That's all Dr. Odine's work. When it comes to knowledge about the sorceress, he's number one. Thanks. So why do you need to see this doctor? Sorceress Ultimicia is alive. She's able to take control of my body at any time. If that were to happen, I would once again bring terror. I, too, value my well-being. I want to protect myself. If it were possible, I would like to rid myself of the sorceress's power. Dr. Odine may know a way. He may be able to save me. I understand. Let's all go to Esthar. Yo, they're back! The two of them went to take a look. How's it going, Squall? Is Renoa still asleep? Tss, tss, tss. <laughs> Renoa's so cute when she's asleep. Whatever. So, how is it? Can we make it to Esthar? <laughs> Are you blushing? Selfie, don't make Squall angry. Esther's on this continent. Ah, bah. Just butcher those words. Esther's on this continent, right? It's supposed to be huge. I don't know why, but I can't seem to find it anywhere. Couldn't find it up north or down south. Let's try going east next. Okay. That's right. We can have Edia in our party. I'm gonna. Who else do I want? Quistus. Just the girls. Okay. Let's go. Ladies. <laughs> oh, we need to get out of here before we can use the tent. Oh, okay. <laughs> Thanks for that game. Okay, first we're gonna lay down a safe here. This is for my personal use. As I love playing as Edia. Anyways, let's go back then. I suppose we should like actually save save. <laughs> we're here here in G Garden Auditorium. Um, and let's pop a tent because I think we have like a billion of them. Yep. Great. Okay, we're healed. Let's go! Wish I could see shit. This is... Ooh. Hello? I don't see a city. Looks like we're in for a long trip. Everything will be alright. We'll be by your side all the way. Thank you, Cell. But remember, you must stay alert, even in my presence. As long as I can be myself, everything will be so fine, but if Ultimicia gets inside me again, you all know what to do. What? What? Did I miss something? Oh, it's so quiet. The air's getting heavy. Guys, what's wrong? Come on! We're all together again. We're gonna bring her back from we're all together again. We're going to bring back Renoa. It's like a picnic. We're going to have fun. Somebody once told me that if you mention bad things, they'll come true. I know it's a silly superstition, but right now I want to believe it. So let's not talk about it anymore. Ah, it's been so long since I did so much talk in my throat. No, we're good. This is the party we're taking. Has not changed. Got anything to say? Any, anybody? No. Okay. Let's go. Let's go. Don't know where I'm going, but we're going there. Um. Not what I needed. Quistus. Those abilities. Okay. Fine. I want 
move fine, though. I have a feeling... Oh, I can walk up this dinosaur? What? Okay. <laughs> okay. Sure. Another. Thundaga. Whatever. What has Squall currently got? It's been a while. <laughs> it's been a hot minute. Okay. How about Adia? Here's a question for y'all. Do you say her name as Edia or Adia? I think Adia is the correct pronunciation, but I just tend to to countrify it into Edia. Is this like one thing or three things? What am I looking at here? Hey! <laughs> She's like, I'm a stab ya. Ow. Uh, yeah, draw some hastes. We can make use of those. Oh, the hands are separate targets. And they all... Every single one of them has something different. Okay, it's fine. Just kill the head. It was weird. He's casting protect on his hands. Gotta make sure my finger's safe. Lightweights. What? What is a lightweight? Uh, drain? I don't know. I don't know! Stop! Couldn't steal. Who knows what the fingers hold? Protect on it. Speaking of which, give me some of those protects. Give them here. Wizard stones, that's what it had. I think those are the Aga level spell stones. Rude. <laughs> it's like, oh. Carbunkle. Um. Carbuncle. What can you learn now, Carbuncle? Yeah, learn that. Um. What do we have now? <laughs> Mid magic refinery. Oh yeah, what does... Oh, it's not gonna tell me. Shoes to make you light on your feet. Wait, wait, wait. 
an inferno fang. Sweet! Oh! Cute. Not at all necessary. Don't need that, but cute. It's not something I think I've really gone into on stream, but the more a specific character summons a particular guardian force, their compatibility increases with that guardian force. And apparently you can give them items to have the same effect. What that means overall is that as a compatibility increases, that summon will appear more and more quickly when they're called. It's why when we were fighting Tonberries, Diablos ended up coming up like, snap, 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 every time um, Selfie summoned her. Him. Her. Diablos could be either. We don't actually know. Give me your lightweight shoes. <laughs> Ooh, I need your shoes. Good job. I... Oh, hello. I vaguely recall what you're supposed to do here. I have beaten this game before. It was like... God. My God, it was like, what, 12 years ago? Ah, I feel old! I'm hoping we'll get to see... Hey, thanks, Sid. Well, hi. Well, that was extremely natural and flexible animation <laughs> just <clears throat> as a whole model lifted into the air turned and sat down <laughs> an undead monster use recovery related magic and items I mean I will I want to rob it first I kinda wanna see Edia's limit break. Love watching her counter. Like, no! Ah, attack! What I do want to know is why Edia is still wearing this outfit. Like, I get that she wore the dress, like, before, which is fine. But does she need, like, the gold headpiece thing? Or, like, the. Skull clamp pointy hat thing? Like, Edia girl, what you doing? So, the secret to this boss, if you haven't picked up on it, is that as an undead, it can be. It can be, um. killed with healing magic. Which can mean, of course, you can cast, like, Kira and. Hiraga and Regine on it to like damage it and poison it, which is all well, okay, terrifying, which is all well and good. But in actuality, what you're supposed to do is just either cast life or use a phoenix down on it, since those things bring the dead back to life, it kills undeads instantly. Come on, Quisis. I would like to murder this thing. I cannot do so until you have successfully robbed it. You're dragging on this fight for no good reason. He is gonna... Okay.
Poor Edia. Stop! Great! Okay. Get up, Adia! What are you doing, girl? Oh my god, Quistus, please. I'm keeping Edia in low health in the hopes that she will use her, uh, her limit break, her overdrive, her aura, whatever this game calls it, I'm not sure. I think this game uses limit break. It is a collar. If you see closer on her head, oh, sorcery! If you see closer on her head, she's actually wearing like a like a, a a skull cap thing with this like nautilus shell and some horns. The gold thing is attached to her 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 neckline. Huh? For some reason, a power wrist. Thank you. Okay, do we have... Can we end this? Rude! Don't be wasting hyper- Okay, that's not a waste. Ah, <laughs> suck that. But, uh, I got a better one. Missed! Okay, uh... Well, stop. Stop! What's happening? Despite being silenced, she can still cast Ice Strike. Which does, like, no damage, but is awesome to look at. Okay, I guess we're just doing this over and over. Oh my god! Stop confusing us! I mean, it doesn't. It's... She's a sorcerer. It's innate. It's in her blood. She's not casting a spell. She's just doing a thing. Mega Phoenix! That's a waste as hell! Stop! Missed! Stop, Beastus! Oh, she dead. I would like to show off like a phoenix down killing one of these things. It keeps missing because it's rude.
We just killed it the old-fashioned way. That's fine. Yay. No experience. Shiva. Diabolos. Cerberus. Alexander. Okay. Shiva. I don't think... <clears throat> I don't think you have anything else you can learn. Diabolos. This is brothers. Diabolos. Let's go with magic plus 40. Who's the others? Alexander? Oh, and Cerberus. Double C effective medicine. Ooh. Ooh. Heard that. Cerberus. Yeah, learn the uh, stat junctions first. Okay. And we got high magic refining? We do indeed. Oh yeah. What is... oh. Into a triple! Oh! Yeah. Hmm. No. We'll wait. I'll sort out everybody's magic when we're not. My high potion plus is gone. <laughs> when we're not like lost in a salt sea. That'll work. Okay. Well, that was a thing. There's something here. What is that? How can there be a hole in midair? This looks like the only way. very accepting of just whatever is happening. What is this place? What is happening here? Who made this place? I have the slightest clue. I don't know what I'm doing, where I am. I don't know if we'll ever get to Estar, but I don't care. The 70s porn funk beat is just Final Fantasy VIII's music. That's just how this game is. I'm not turning back now. Can I move? Yep, yeah, okay. Up, uh, up, uh, okay. It stopped. Is that it? Looks like we're here. Let's go, girls. Squall, what are you thinking? I don't care at this point. Nothing's gonna surprise me. What else? Let's go. What is this? My goodness! What is going to happen now? Estar looks great, but these are some like 
Holy shit, OSHA violation. Like, they're going so fast with, like, no, no safety rails. Like, oh my god. That's what I'm here for. If I can't force Shania Twain on you by proxy, what am I even doing? Judging from their technology, they must know we're here. It's possible we might encounter some hostility, so stay alert. Uh, no, not now. This isn't good. <laughs> oh, oh, excuse you. <laughs> Can't junction idea, I guess. It's fine, I'll have to... <laughs> the skinny one and the fat one. Get your asses down to Lunatic Pandora. You're gonna stay here and work. The rest of you get back to work. Okay, you have things. If you've forgotten, at the end of the last dream episode, I'm hungry. You, I said no talking. It's only been three days, you wimp. When I was young, I worked all day, all night, without sleep. Uh, at the end of the last dream episode, um, Kiros and Laguna fled a dragon into Esthar, accidentally. I wonder if Kyrus and Ward, Ward are working too. No talking! How many times do I have to... Oh, meal time! Alright, it's time to eat. You keep working. That's what you get for your big mouth. That beast over there, you too. No meal until your work is done. Hey, you can't be serious. It'll be done in two to three hours, but his job won't get done for days. He just won't get fed for a few days. If he wants to eat, he should work faster. Come, give me a hand. I can't handle the big guy alone. Don't do anything stupid while I'm gone. The camera is watching you. You alright? You look exhausted. Do they feed you alright? Got a fever or something? Or are you just scared of heights? Your stomach's going... <laughs> That's funny. I think that things means thank you. You know what? You're the first one to care about his well-being. These Moombas get worked to death for no reason. They only get half the food and sleep compared to us humans. That's horrible! You need to get out of here! When we get out of here, I'll feed you all the food you want. And you'll get to nap all you want. How's that? Arr. Experiment, experiment, let's just do this. Ah, uh, this is a failure. Sounds like Dr. O'Dine's up to something again upstairs. Huh? What's up? You need a tool? I'll go get it. Wait right here. I think there was one here. Hey, you over there. Yeah, standing next to the elevator. Go get the guard upstairs. Tell them there's an emergency. Roger that. Emergency. Maybe the guys are up to something? Go now! Alright, I'm going. Oh. I almost forgot. Here, catch. Whoa! Jeez, that was close. I'm so glad. I'm so, so glad. You're such a nice guy. How many guys like you these days? You seem like you'd be a good candidate to be our leader. A leader. That's right. A lot of us are dissatisfied with the way a... <clears throat> I'm choking. <clears throat> with the way Adele's been ruling Esthar. 
So I thought I'd bring it up to this random slave. We may be disorganized now, but someday we'll gather our forces to remove Adele from power. We're overthrowing the ruler of a country, a sorceress far beyond our powers. A half-baked plan would never work. We're waiting for the right time now. Most of us involved in the Adele resistance are specialists. It's easy to research ways to fight Adele, but there's no one to lead the movement. That's our situation right now. We've been looking for someone like you, someone who's strong and righteous. Hey, did you go tell him? What are you doing? Up to no good again, aren't ya? Stop! Why does Laguna have a machine gun? Who was like, yes, allow this slave to keep his machine gun. It's fine. Don't move! Darn it, I did it again. Well, too bad. <coughs> Just get on and go! <coughs> ah. Lol, your joke. So hilarious. Kuro's ward! Great timing! <coughs> or should I say, bad timing? Stop talking and just keep walking. It's not so bad. Two is better than one. Four is better than two, right? So who's the fourth one? Jeez, are you starting to hallucinate? Yeah, I can see it. Ah, oh, my sweet Al. You make your uncle so happy. Hey, now's our chance. You know what to do? Let's just finish them off and get out of here. Before we do that, we all get up? N no. We are not. Everything else. Perfect. All right, let's go. I much prefer Laguna's battle so uh, song than, um... Squalls. Gotcha! Oh, it's Laguna. Just kill a man! Got two black holes! I don't think we've seen Kiros, Laguna, or Ward Slender. Well, we've seen Lagunas. Because he, like, summons a helicopter and, like, swings from it and shoots things. Jailbreak!
Not that way, apparently. <laughs> Dr. O'Dyne! No security guard. Now's our chance. Vati's Luna weep. Moon, listen. Oh, I was gonna take him hostage. That's fine. Hello, sir. Hey, you waited for me? Yeah. Stay on your toes. Don't want to get captured again. Darn it. I promised him a meal and a nap when we get out. Well, I guess he's better off running free. It's okay. He's also an Adele Resistance member. He's Dr. O'Dyne's res assistant. All the hot info about the lab comes from him. See a new member? Welcome to our group. You made quite a noise down there. Well, this may be a good time to leave this facility. Did something happen to the doctor? Or did Adele stop funding his lab? No, it's Dr. O'Dyne. He's, he's done it again. He's found a new toy he prefers over a big one like the lunatic Pandora. Some child named Alone. Alone? You know her? Know her? She's really the only reason why we're here. Where is she? Where's Alone? Dr. O'Dyne would probably know her whereabouts. So look for O'Dyne, right? We're going back. Thanks for all your help. Better go someplace safe now. Adios. Wait a second, I still owe you. If you're looking for that girl alone, you'll eventually need help. Facing Esthar and Adele with only the three of you will be difficult. Why not let us help you? We'll provide you with all the information you'll need. She has certainly been very busy. It's not a bad idea. We don't know anything about Esthar. I never want to go through all this again. I'm sure Ward feels the same way. Huh? Mm, okay, fine. We'll accept your help. In return, we'll help your anti Zell movement or whatever. It's Adele. Start listening more closely, because it's getting embarrassing, is what Ward would say. Can't you see it in his eyes? Yeah, sure. I always see it. But who cares? I speak with passion, from the heart. That's what matters most. Yeah, that's right. It all sounds crazy, but I like you. I really want you to be our leader. Leave it to me. Once we find a loan, I'll take up that offer. Well, let me go pay a little visit to Odine. Wait right here. Darn it, did it again. Why don't I ever think things through before I answer? Well, it's been okay till now. I'm sure things will work out. I just want... Death! <laughs> Okay. It's real ominous that that is, like, right outside Dr. O Odin's lab. Dr. Odin would probably know her whereabouts. And what do you got to say? Nothing? Okay. Hey, thanks for the host, Mystic. Um. Okay. Back in we go. Where did he go? Weapons Monthly first issue. <laughs> okay. They worked hard on this animation, and by God, are they going to use it. Dr. Odin, where's Alone? Can't believe you guys came back! You fools! Fool! This time we have a floating tentacle robot. You have no hope! <laughs> oh! <laughs> it's 
falls over and dies. I don't know what it just did. I wasn't paying attention to the spell it cast, but it missed. Give me Thundara. Oh God, I'm Kira Laguna. I meant Ward. Damn. Meltdown. Give me that. Give me that meltdown. A laser cannon. Why can this robot cast magic? Uh... <laughs> Sir? Okay, we killed it. What are you saying? I do not know any alone. Okay, I was, was lying. Alone. I know alone. Hey, wait. Where's alone? I'm talking about alone. Where did you... Why did you not grab him in the elevator, Laguna? Why did you just stand behind him ominously? Hey, wait, tell me where? In Zero Lab. Alone is there. He means Odine's laboratory. To go there, go over here, then over there, and then here. I see. I didn't understand a word. Kiros, it's your show from here. We can all steal a car, I guess. We'll be joining you as soon as we can. Until then, good luck. Please be careful. This is the place, right? This place sure is weird. Hey, where'd he go? I think he must be looking for us. Yeah, you wouldn't usually jump out of a car. Oh, he just kind of sped off. I hope he's alright. Besides, we're... Wait till you see Adele. She is one of my favorite villains in Final Fantasy history. I love her. Fuck you! Brothers learned HP bonus. I don't remember who has, I think it's Laguna. Hell yeah. Okay, what else can you learn, brothers? Mm, sure. Learn more summoning damage, it's fine. Double! No good, it won't open. 
What, what the? Sit down. <laughs> the guy finally shows up just as we leave. There are a lot of draw points in this, like, tiny little section. Flare! I want Ward to draw it because he can draw more because he's better at magic. But then I want him to give it to Laguna. <laughs> give me your flares. Hmm. <laughs> Die, please. Anyways, what was he looking at? Unlocked. Oh, the door down there. Okay. <gasps> Alone! Alone? Alone! Darn, she can't hear me. Ride the, the the butt elevator with absolutely no guardrails at all. Moving at high speeds to the side. Hey, that one's ready to be chugged again. Get them doubles. Hurry, go see her. Alone! Uncle Laguna! See? I told you I'd come save you. Sorry, I'm a little late, but... Squall, are you alright? Look, there's something coming. Sorceress Idia? Yes, we came here to see Dr. Odine. Please explain... Ah, please explain what this is regarding. Yes, of course. I want to see alone. Where is she? Alone? Squall, calm down. Trust me. Let me handle this. Please come with us. <laughs> calm down, Squall. I am technically still the leader of Galbadia. Amazing! We'll be arriving at the Presidential Palace shortly. I've never seen a building this big. I hope Dr. Odine is there. This is the very reason- that is the very reason I am here. I seek the doctor's help. I wish to be free of Sorceress Ultimisia's control. That will be easy. We just exercise the sorceress. That is nothing Odine cannot do. 
I leave everything in your hands. So you want to see alone? Where is she? I have to bring Renoa to her. We need to see alone now. So you will take Odine hostage? You are a fool. I don't care. Just take me to alone. Do what she says. I give you permission. Very well. But under one condition. You must let me observe this girl. Well, we would need time to prepare before we take you to alone. So you will leave the girl with us until then? Accept their offer, Squall. You better not do anything to Renoa. You should have a look around the city. When you're ready, head eastward to Lunar Gate and meet us there. We should be ready by then. We have advanced much since the sorceress's reign. I hope you enjoy our city. Oh, this is quite mysterious. So this is what happens. Oh, we'll take the girl there. There's nothing to worry about. Just head to Lunar Gate. Okay. I'm gonna be honest, this place would be terrifying to be in. Hello? Entry not permitted. Okay. It was good exploration. Good talk, guys. Sure. I mean, that's cool and all, but I feel a walkway would just be more convenient, since you can have more than three people ratted at a time. Sightseeing? Actually, you were in the palace, so you must be here for some important reason. Wow, how long has it been since we had visitors? A car? It looked unusual. Blizzard! Sure. The capital is divided into two sides. This side is called the left side. Dr. Odine's laboratory is on this side. You can take the lifter via Star Air Station to get there. Huh? Let's walk. Maybe. The game really wants us to just get on one of these lifts. I'm like, nope! <laughs> I refuse! Ice magic is best magic. Okay. Ah, so... You can tell it where to take you. Is there, like, a shopping district? I got money to... Oh, there's a draw set point! Quick! I'm sorry, the doctor gave strict labs not to let anyone inside the lab. Strip labs? Strip orders to not give let anyone in the lab. I can read. I'm in a safe spot right here. I haven't come out here to take a break. Great place, huh? Yeah, no, I don't need this. Where can this take me? Hmm. Air station! Hello? The air station is temporarily closed. Here! Go explore our city! 
Everything's closed. You have permission to enter no buildings, but you can walk on our glass roads. It's fine. You can also float around on our seat elevators that don't have handrails or guardrails or walls. Riki. Thanks for that deep conversation, guy. Riki. It's like, please go. Just stop my movement. Move, Mr. Estar Soldier. Ah, oh, God. I'm up here now, apparently. <laughs> Ah! What is this? <laughs> there is no differentiation between, like... Kiraga. I think we're all full on Kiraga. Uh, there's no differentiation between, like, road and sidewalk where people walk. It's just... Sure? Thanks, Sid. Hello. What's going on? Hey! Okay. Good talk. <gasps> what was that? Excuse you. Please go. Please go. What are you stuck on? Where can this take us? Shopping mall. That's what I wanted. Gotta spend those dollars. Uh, yeah. I'm here to do my capitalist duty. And spend that money. I told you not to touch your screen, didn't I? I couldn't help it. Thanks to you, I had to buy 999 potions. <laughs> oh. You like to go shopping? Yes. Ren Ren's store. The pet shop. Cloud's shop. Item shop. Johnny's shop. Item shop. Don Juan shop, junk shop, Karen's store, bookstore, Cheryl's store. Cheryl's store is closed. We're having a sale. Yay, Cloud. Let's spend a little money. Uh, let's buy a few more Phoenix Stones. I, well, never mind. We're full. Johnny's shop. Here you go. She's the high potion. What the? Yes, exactly like when Ali bought Jess that thing. The drink. The alcohol. This is what happens when you allow your children to touch things. <laughs> What's the bookstore sailing? Sure. That was expensive. Okay. 
Yes, exit, please. Goodbye. Right. Oh, she knows that. Okay. Let's see what we got. Opens monthly. That's not what I need to look at. Combat King 3. Combat King 4. I, I think I have to look at these for Zell to actually learn these. Propels 2. And to lower cover. We know that. Propels 5. Chill search. And wishing star. Huh. Don't be sassy me, selling books. Occult fan one, mysterious monster death. Odell Burke, 67, of Timber, was tending to his field when he found a dead monster after hearing a loud impact sound. Mr. Burke said it occurred while he was making a fence with steel pipes. Hint number one. Occult fan two, it's an unidentified flying object. On the left is a photo shoot shot in... A photo shoot... In Esthar. Take a look at the unidentified flying object in the center. Have you ever seen any monster or airplane like this? Some say it may be Esthar's secret weapon, but residents of the area say it appears when there's a major Marlboro outbreak. We've actually, um... We've actually run into the, uh, the UFO before. Because I had encounter none on, so I shouldn't run into anything. But they don't count as fights. So it just showed up and, like, was flying away, I think, with, like, a pyramid or something? Yeah, we ran into that. We've seen it, we believe. Uh, sort. Please? Okay, so because of that, we should be able to... Set. Ooh, oh, we didn't have Angelo recover. Let's start with Angelo search. It does look just like the OSHA violation car elevator. <laughs> tornado found. Just find a tornadoes. That's fine. What should I get? Excuse me, where did you buy your clothes? <laughs> oh, is this the same directory? Yeah. Since we have all the weapons monthly, is it gonna show us, um... No. Rude. Okay, well, before we go, I'm gonna buy a few more... Ooh, remedies. Yes, please. And some softs. Yes, please. And Phoenix Downs. Okay. It's like, please let me leave. Goodbye. Have a nice journey. Okay. Reach at the Presidential Palace. And from there, we can go east to the Lunar Gate and go on with the story. So all I wanted to do was go shopping. I wanted to spend that money. Say, take me to the presidential palace. No, no, this is not where I want to go. Oh, it did. More blizzard. 
Fortunately, hats have been banned in the society. Or at least the one Skull came from. Apparently in S-Star, though, everyone's got one. Don't worry. Nine has hats. They will return in nine. And then will disappear again. For a while. <laughs> Up, oh, up, oh, I'm here again. Sometimes you have to change your premise. Oh, this is not where I want it to be, actually. Everybody sit back down. We're going back. Whee! <laughs> what are we looking at, Squall? <laughs> what an incredible city. They have instant online shopping. Rent a car? Fuck yeah. I'll rent a car. Would you like to rent a car for Gil? Ha <laughs> ha! Oh my god! I can't see and <sighs> Oh, this is This is woo. <laughs> okay. Um This is a quick question game. Where the fuck am I headed? like to save the game, please. Crash into a building. <laughs> I wish I could, honestly. I cannot, though. Okay. Now buttons. Buttons do things. Oh, is that where I'm supposed to go? Lunar Gate? Ah, oh, it's the bridge. Bruh. I'm too close. It won't let me out. Now well. Okay. I'm immediately gonna fight. Fuck Fantasy Tactics. GTA crossover. That would be interesting. He's like, I will kill you. Oh yeah, give me those lives. Rude. with life force. Carbuncle learned. Leviathan learned. Well, did they? Hmm. 
Where's the Python? Okay, can we, go, can we go in now? That big hunk of rock that was here? I miss it now that it's gone. It's so bare in here now. Let's get some death up in this house. <laughs> Take it, Adia! Adia stopped 12 deaths! This is the only game where the Final Fantasy characters just go adventuring with their mom. <laughs> Come on, mom! Let's go get you unpossessed! It's still standing there, but they don't do anything in there now. When the research subject moves elsewhere, I guess they move with it. Okay, well, I'm a guess this is not where I'm supposed to be. Uh, yes, and his teacher. To be fair, his teacher is the same age. It's still creepy because she's in a position of power, but... At least it's not like she's 40 and he's like 18. <laughs> Take those small victories where we can get them. It is. This is still very much power imbalance. Hey, at least she felt bad about it. Is this it? Is this where I'm supposed to go? Fuel remaining. 15. I know. I don't think this is where I'm supposed to go. It's like an ominous building out in the middle of a field. Hi there. Off limits. Great. Bye. <laughs> okay. We're in the nine hells of the lunar gate. Hey, I am not going to defend Quistus having a crush on Squall. Especially because why would you have a crush on Squall? He has that, like... He has the, like, the young adult fantasy problem of, like, Squall himself is... At least in the beginning of the game, was rude, was angsty, was introverted, didn't talk to people, and everybody still absolutely loved his shit. Like, why? Dude, he's mean. Stop. Is this it? Who knows? We're gonna fight something. We're gonna fight a horse. Or two. Give me more lives. Ow. I'm supposed to be? Welcome to Lunar Gate. It is! We found it. Our staff is waiting for you inside the complex. I guess it would make sense if I followed the walkway. <laughs> so good at this game! We've been expecting you. Please, this way. Whoa! Angelo? It's gonna be okay. I'll take care of Renoa. Lead the way, please. Are you the ones taking off? Yes. Okay, this way. 
Taking off where? What? Distance-wise, it's pretty far, but you'll be there in no time. You'll be there by the time you wake up. Where are we going? Let me give you a quick explanation about the whole process. First, we need you to enter the capsule inside this pipe. Here, you'll undergo the cold sleep process. Once this process is complete, your capsule will automatically be loaded into the booster. After that, we launch. You should be there by the time you wake up. Leave the rest of the staff once you get there. Well, that's about it in a nutshell. I won't say there isn't any risk involved. What do you want to do? Space. Let me think about it. I'll do whatever it takes. Let's do it. Okay, you need to decide who you're taking. The girl in blue has already undergone cold sleep and has been loaded in. There's room for one more. In the meantime, something must be done to suppress my powers. But it'd be too dangerous for Matron to be alone. Well, let me be your escort. Come on, Squall, what do you say? Yeah, trust Cell. That's fine. Okay, I'll leave it in Cell's hands. All the gates. In Cell's hands. Oh, yeah! I'll do whatever it takes to watch over you. Don't worry about a thing. Mom. Squall, don't worry about us. Matron is a sorceress. Don't forget that. Okay, let's decide who's going. Uh, Irving. Edia, give your magic to Renoa. I have a feeling it's going to come up. So let's just do it. Yeah! Let's do this. Okay then, those who are going, get in. I feel like I should, like, watch Critical Role. But I haven't. Okay, bye, Irving. <laughs> Just gets right in. Leave it to me, Squall. Don't worry about us. Okay, get in. Everything will work out, Squall. Gotta say goodbye to my friends before we get to space. Squall, Renewal will be fine. And I'm already, like, deep, deep, like, years and years. God. Like, six years deep into a critical hit. So I don't know if I can justify getting into critical role as well. All capsules are in place. Conditions inside the capsules are normal. Boosters on standby. All systems normal. Launch error correction plus two. Orbital correction minus one. Corrections complete. Go! Clear. 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 Yeah, the cartoon would definitely help. Man, I hope everything goes well. I think they'll be alright. They'll be fine. Let's pray for their safe return. Okay, shall we go? Hey, come back! Hey, stop! What the? Whoa! I like how the twins are... Synchronized worry looking. Let's go outside. What the hell is that? It's humongous! Isn't the city over there? 
Dr. O'Dine, he might be in danger. Zell, we better head to the, for the city at once. Dr. O'Dine might know what's going on. Alright, who's coming with us? Uh, great. Let's go! You stay here, Quistus, with this dog. Just do a little bit of healing there. Let's get in our car. I don't want to fight monsters on the way. If I can avoid it. Great, where's the city? Exactly? City? Oh no. We've lost the city. There it is. Oh, oh whoop. Okay. Bye. <laughs> Let's go. Hey, speaking of animated, I would love to see our own D&D &D game animated. Okay. Do, do Odin's laboratory. Come on, Dr. Odine. Oh, what was this? Tornado? Quake. I mean, you're right. It's probably never going to happen because we're all poor, but... That don't mean I wouldn't like it. Are you here to see the doctor? Yeah. Dr. Odine is in a good mood right now. He hasn't been this striffle in quite a while. Give me those doubles. Oh yeah, 15 of them. That flare still hasn't refilled even though it's been like 12 years. Why is Lunatic blah, blah. Oh my god, this accent. Why is Lunatic Pandora here now? Who is moving that thing? Gabadians, sir. They're the ones that salvaged it. We must sound the alert in the city now. It will not attack us. The city is not the target. I hope so. I hope you're right. But tears point. Hmm? Thanks, Sid. So we meet again? This is exciting! Actually, I think he said exciting. What's so exciting about this? This and that about Gabadi and all. It's been a long time since I last saw Lunatic Pandora. That Lunatic whatever, that big thing. What the hell is that? What the hell is going on? Oh, you want to hear my story? That is nice. I would be happy to tell you. I've been investigating the Pandora since it was excavated. So we serviced it. And investigated. 
I don't care about that. What do you want? What's gonna happen? What do we do? That is what I'm about to... The enemy's coming, right? And there's no time. We'll do something about it. Just tell us what to do. Make it short. Short, eh? Are you sure about that? That is too bad. Yes, this could be very bad. You want to go inside to stop it. Then look at this. This is a map of the Esther region. Lunatic Pandora's current location is here. Lunatic Pandora's expected course. It will undoubtedly pass over the city. Zoom in map. Why is Esther shaped like a giant freaking spider? The city has one outer skyway and two main inner skyways, all leading to the palace. Lunatic Pandora will head east from the vicinity of this lab towards the shopping mall. The time it will take to cross the city is estimated to be 20 minutes. Boarding Lunatic Pandora is possible at the following three contact points. The first contact point is at the center of the city. It will arrive there five to eight minutes after it enters the city. This is equivalent to 15 to uh, 12 left on your timer. The second contact point is unknown. We believe it is where the two skyways cross. Lunatic Pandora will arrive there 10 to 15 minutes after it enters the city. This is 10 to 5 on your timer. The third contact point is north of the shopping mall. It will arrive here 17 minutes after it enters the city. Yeah, I do see tick now that you say that. So it's 3 to 0 left on your timer. End of briefing. I want to know... I want to know why Dr. Odine had a plan to board Lunatic Pandora if it flies over the city just on the ready. <laughs> that is how it goes. I give you this. Look at it with S. The problem is... Alright, alright. We gotta get going. I want to talk some more. The culprit is not Galbadia. You care to elaborate there? What do you want? Yeah, what's the first one? Center of the city. Okay, I think we will head to... the over overcross undercross contact zone so i think we can get there safely and quickly enough and then we will board lunatic pandora looks like it's here Give me a second, I gotta I gotta get these quakes. Where is it? There it is. The Gavadian stopped us from approaching that thing. It's heading for the center. A spite? With who? Oh, Gabadians. That makes sense. <laughs> You're gonna die now. <laughs> I'm gonna just punch you to death. Tornado! Ah! That's what that does. Hey! <laughs> we found! This is the last contact point!
Could we go? We need up there! Got to go around. Luckily, I don't think the timing on this is too harsh. Especially because we're not aiming for the first contact zone, we're aiming for the second. Thank you, Odin. Unfortunately, I have to sit through your animation now, so... That's gonna eat up some time, but... Thanks! Go, team, go. Yeah, that's the way we came. Okay, um... Well... Damn! Not entirely sure how to get there now. This way, maybe? Yes! Wait, what? What looks nothing like Anthony Hopkins? What are you talking about? Oh, Odin! Okay. That took a second. <laughs> it's like, Anthony Hopkins? <laughs> what? I get it now. Supposed to do what now? Oh, we made the first contact point. Oh, <laughs> you definitely had to Google the actor's name. <laughs> the effort we put in for our jokes. Okay. I don't need to do anything. You can just <laughs> let Odin take care of everything. Thanks, Odin. Buddy. Palo. Friendo. Now's a chance! I like how they only show Zell making that jump, because there's no way they're gonna animate, uh, a Dia. Making that damn jump. <laughs> nope. Not happening. <laughs> Where is this? Oh. <laughs> Kiraga. I mean, 
Good adventurers go left, so let's go left. Hello? Holy? Oh, yeah. Give me holy. Ah, good. A safe spot. Okay. I'm going to save and end the stream here, because, uh... My tailbone hurts. I'm tired of sitting. And also, it's, like, approaching lunchtime. In an hour. So, I'm in the stream here. Uh, I will probably stream again. Monday. Next week. <laughs> There's something happening every night this week, so... Yeah! Monday, next week. Look forward to that! I, I will take care of my broken tail. Thanks for the concern. Have a nice day. See you later. Bye-bye.